Hey guys, it's Lane and Blake from Redefine Horizons. And one of the things we try and do at Redefine Horizons is we try and have excellent communication with our clients. And one of the ways we do that is with what we call a job status update. And that's a written document that follows a standard format uh, that allows our client to just basically get an update on what's happening on their project. And so what I want to show you today is how we put those together. So I've got a project up, it's a job we're working on in Tracy, and uh, we're going to do a new project status update. We try and do these once a month. Uh, sometimes we'll get to a, a kind of a holding pattern on a project. Sometimes we're waiting for client review or we're waiting for site access or for a local agency review. And so sometimes we'll go a month or two without a status update, but we try and do them at least monthly. And if it's a, if it's a fast moving project, we might even do them weekly or bi-weekly. But we try and do them regularly. So you can see this project's been on hold for a little while. The last update I did was in uh, October. Uh, so we're a little overdue. Uh, we've done a bunch of work on this in January. It's the first of February today or second of February. And so uh, we want to make sure that we give the client an update. So here's what an update looks like. It's just a PDF. I'll show you real quick what, what one of those uh, updates looks like when it's finished. So here it is, uh, some information on the job here. Uh, and then this always follows the same format. So here we talk about our recently completed work. We talk about next steps for our team. Uh, then if we're working with a land attorney or another partner, we'll talk about uh, what we recommend their next steps will be. And then we just give the client any of our recommendations and, and any advisories that we have. And so that's what a job status update uh, looks like. And then uh, we link to that on the client's project page, which I'll, I'll show you in another video. So what we want to do is we want to go ahead and make a new one of these. So I'm just going to copy a previous one we did on this project. And these are We keep these in the, uh, if I go up to the root of the job, uh, we keep these in the communications out folder. So I'm going to do today's date. Just say job status update. Okay. And we'll paste our Word doc in here. And we're just going to change the date on there. Okay. And then we'll open this up and we'll go ahead and update it for this project. It should just take a few minutes. 